A family in East China's Jiangxi province has spent the last 70 years guarding a cemetery where veterans of the anti-Japanese war are buried. The tradition began with a man who fought in the same war. Yo Hanqing fought the Japanese in December 1941 at the Battle of Gaofeng in Jiangxi. About 1,000 Chinese soldiers died in the battle. The remains were later buried in a cemetery on a mountain in Longtan Township in the city of Gaowan. Yo Hanqing gave up his chance to attend the military academy. He didn't return to his hometown either. Instead, he chose to stay in Longtan and guard the cemetery until his death in 1999. After that, his family has continued to guard the cemetery in accordance with his requests made in his will. Yo Hanqing's hometown is in southwest China's Yunnan province. After the war, he married a woman in Longtan and had four sons. The family lives less than 500 meters away from the cemetery. My father told me this, that soldiers all came from the same province as him. They were all young with no offspring. That's why he decided to guide their cemetery. Yo Hanqing opened a tea shop to support his family after the war. Before his death, he told his sons to guard the ceremony and mourn the deceased on Tomb Sweeping Day and during the Ghost Festival, both of which are holidays held to pay homage to the dead. Yo Hanqing himself was buried in the same cemetery with his fellow soldiers. Primary and middle school students sometimes visit the cemetery to learn more about the war. The cemetery used to be full of weeds, but now it's much better. It has been expanded and cleared up. <laughs>